Okay, in this video clip, uh, let's uh, look at the way to find the number of arrangement. Okay, the number of arrangement, five cards out of eight cards, whereby S and T need to be included. Okay, because the answer scheme given is actually answer that question, not this question. So we are actually looking for number of ways to arrange five cards okay to arrange five cards whereby okay s and t need to be included so the solution here is for combination that is to select any five cards whereby s and t must be in but over here s and t must be in we have to arrange the five cards that we have chosen okay so with that uh, let's start with the first scenario here st and then zero i and then the three others okay what are the three others we have p v and then o e and then the i so out of this double i yeah? out of this eight letters we just need to choose five st is ST must be in, so we don't count it anymore, okay? There is only one way to choose S and T. That is the only way. That's why it's one. We don't have to count that. So let's look at this one. Or the second scenario will be ST with one I and the other two letters. Or we may have ST with double I and one others all right so let's find the arrangement with this so i will use the fill in the blank method one two three um uh, st must be in but it never mentioned it never mentioned this uh, condition whereby which one how does it start okay since st must be in and then we just need to choose the remaining three letters to permute with the st okay no i so don't choose from i so we shall have 4c3 okay number of ways to choose that and then followed by now add together with the s and t that need to be included with five letters here so permute the five letters okay no extra condition is imposed here so we just select any three out of the out of the four others and then permute it or so let's plus same thing we already know the selection we just select any two from the others that means four c2 four items here we just choose any two once we have to make the choice with the number of choice that we make four c2 Okay, we make up five letters. We just permute that five letters. All right. And then when two I's must be in, so we will have, we're being biased. ST, two I, no need to choose anymore. We just need another one to permute with ST and two I. Therefore, four C1 and multiply with five factorial. We arrange all five because we have repeated items I. So we have to divide by two factorial there. So with this, let's use the calculator. So we have 4C3. Times with 5 factorial. Then we plus 4C2. Times with 5 factorial. And then we plus 4C1 times with 5 factorial, but this time we have to divide by 2 factorial. So our answer is 1440. So this is the answer given in the in the answer scheme, but that that is the correction that I need to highlight 
This is to find the number of arrangement, okay, to arrange the five cards. But the question here is asking about to select the five cards. Okay, so 14 is the correct answer. Okay, this one, uh, some mistake there.